Welcome to the third semester of the Beaver Hockey Wire. Not new to the program, but new to the roster since last semester, is forward Jared McIntosh. He took a year off hockey to focus on his studies. The boys are back from break and hard at work in preparation for their road trip to Arizona, working off those home-cooked meals, holiday baking, and other holiday activities. It was a good break, but don't just take it from me. Favorite present. I think uh, what I got from Santa in the stocking was a fart machine. I think that was probably my favorite. You know, with the remote control, put it in somewhere and push the button and fart. My like favorite present, I got some new uh, underwear, some socks. Are you going to take that to Arizona? Uh, well, it's at my house right now, but I think I might need to go home and uh, maybe I should pick it up for a little prank for the guys. So you never know. I'm not going to say yes or no, it'll be a surprise. Yeah. Like, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, put them on first time. Like, yeah. Nothing like ever yeah. before. I got a pair of thermal socks. They're uh, pretty awesome. I got a, uh, about a four foot long, two foot high crib board for, to play cribbage on the lot. Well, I got a nice pair of blue lemon pants. Uh, I got actually a full picture of Sidney Crosby's golden goal from the Olympics and autographed and authentic, so it's a pretty big gift. Uh, probably NHL 13 I got from Santa, got a tree. I got a new TV for Christmas. My favorite present probably, I got a nice shirt from my mother and I also bought myself a TV, so it's about 40 inches. Flat screen, HD, 1080p, 32 inch. Okay, Brett got a... Uh... 40, yeah, so, sorry. Yeah, second best. <laughs> probably, I got quite a bit of money, so probably that. Favorite present, I'd have to say a new watch. All the socks that I got. I got a bunch of new socks, so now I can push back laundry day until I run out of those socks. Okay. It's practical. Oh, geez, I got a lot of good gifts this year. Um, I got a couple pairs of sunglasses. Um, and uh, a couple pairs of Saks underwear. Um, I think my favorite present was uh, a nice blazer to wear to the rink. And uh, yeah, so I'm coming in style. Probably one of my favorite ones. Yeah, you know what those are? <laughs> They're just really comfy underwear that hold. <laughs> it's kind of, it's like a dark gray with uh, kind of like, not checkers, but like pinstripe blue. It's nice, you'll have to see. I got, uh, I got like a lot of good presents. I got a couple uh, pea coats, I got a nice pair of boots, and uh, I also got a Stanley Cup uh, signed goalie stick from the Kings last year, all the members of the cup wing team. So that was pretty cool because they were my favorite team. Favorite present was my new ski jacket. My favorite present was uh, some smelly stuff that uh, you put in the toilet before, you know, if you have company over or something, you just put it inside the toilet, so if they have to go, uh, they put it in there and uh, leaves uh, odor-free bathroom. It's like a lemon smell. Um, I got a home brewing kit for beer, and a pea coat and some other nice clothes. Like poop, poop parati or something? Uh, probably an iPad or a set of DeWalt drills. It was a good Christmas. Yeah, that sound went real big. It's for when the boys come over the schloop, they usually do a number on it, so. This way it's, uh, you smell it, but I also smell it good the whole time. The best part of my break, um, probably just being at home and, uh, getting to eat all my grandma's baking. Uh, I got engaged. Uh, it's pretty awesome. Uh, everything. The, uh, everything. Pierogies and, uh, cookies and baking and everything. Going home, hanging out with friends, and doing a little ice fishing in the midnight bite. That was pretty fun. And just seeing the family and everybody around was a lot of it. I uh, just spent a ton of time with my friends. It was good to get home, and obviously I'm from Vancouver, so it's tough to get home. We lost skating. Uh, it's my best sport. I get to skate with my nephews and stuff, help them out, just doing hockey. And, uh, Got to do a little bit of ice fishing, which I like to do. So. Um, just seeing the whole family. I got to play on the pond with my little cousins, which is always lots of fun. And yeah, get to hang out with the girlfriend and his family. Just, just hanging out at home with my family and my girlfriend. It's nice and relaxing. 
Uh, I'll probably just going home, seeing the family, seeing all the boys get back from school and hockey and stuff, and then we'll, uh, hanging out, doing some mischievous things, but that's what the holiday is for. So. I'll probably seeing the family all again and seeing all the little ones, getting, just getting to see family. Uh, I'm just going home to see like friends and family and stuff like that, and uh, uh, my mom's home cooking. I'm probably just seeing all my family and friends again, a lot of guys um, that play hockey and one guy that was in Europe I saw him again, so for the first time in a while, so that was pretty nice. I guess the time off when snowboarding was also fun, hanging out with family. Probably seeing family and friends that I don't get to see all the time now on the way to school and going to the outdoor rink with some buddies that I don't get to see their own. Getting some relaxing time. It's nice to get home, lay on the couch, sleep in a little bit. I see a lot of family that I don't see very often, some friends, get some hangout time in. Uh, like going skiing and snowboarding at the mountain every day. Just being at home and having good home cooked meals again from my mother. Uh, she cooks good food, so better than having sandwiches all year. Going back and seeing family and friends. Any time with your girlfriend? That too. <laughs> uh, the best part was just the rest of the family and then probably uh, made it up to Edmonton. Herb and I made it to the water park, so uh, got to be little kids for a day and just take in uh, all the fun and exciting water slides. Getting home, uh, relaxing, seeing friends and family, and uh, home cooking, and just all the good stuff. Here's resolution. We were talking about this yesterday. Actually, I said I would be nicer to Brent Fitzwater. Yes, I've been hard on him. Uh, well, he's my stall mate. We sit beside each other. I don't know. Got to get on him once more. I guess to eat better, get a little bit healthier. Okay. No, I don't know. No, I don't. I'm actually thinking about not going to the adult places so much, and I'm thinking about kind of want to get back in shape. So that's probably my resolution. Ah, uh, do better on my schoolwork. <laughs> yeah, right. Three. Buckle down. And hockey and schoolwork, and uh, really worked hard to win that national championship that our team striving for this year. So. I don't really like have one. I never feel like they are changing anything. Um, I'm going to lose 10 pounds. I'm not going to say it. Going to. And uh, for two reasons, so I can be better down the stretch and so I look better for peach season. I like to be in the gym a little more than I have been. Yeah, my New Year's resolution, uh, I don't know, I'm not a big New Year's resolution kind of guy. I just kind of keep going up my thing. Making goals all the time, trying to reach them, so I don't know. I don't, uh, don't really make the, the uh, New Year's resolution at all. Get through another semester of school. The school's really tough right now. Nursing program just comes at you 100 miles an hour, so. Uh, just a senior year, last semester, finished school hard, and uh, yeah, to, uh, Take it one step at a time, just get through this program, finish another year of school, and uh, finish another um, good season of hockey, and hopefully uh, win a national championship with the guys we have this year. Just finish the hockey season hard and make it a successful year. I'm not going to change anything in the new year because I'm perfect the way I am. Uh, well, it's not really my resolution, but it's my parents. They said I got to quit spending so much money. Uh, I gotta cut down on that, so that's a big one. I'd like to win a national championship for my brothers in there. For myself, I guess, uh, probably pick it up school wise, you know, turn it up this next semester and uh, be a better student athlete. I got the athlete part down, so I'll be a student this semester. Win a national championship. But probably just to work out more, and, like, just get stronger and just kind of get, get in better shape and off. So probably that easy. I don't really have one. Just be better all around. And Wyatt Waslinchuk had this episode's slow motion play of the week. Uh, what was your favorite present you got this year? Ooh, favorite present. Thank you for watching this episode of the Beaver Hockey Wire. For all your news and updates on the Beaver Hockey Club, both on and off the ice. This is Jamie Council, signing off.